I talked to several students about their different parts of their nursing journey and how they prepared for their exams. I spent eight to 10 hours every day um, for about four months studying for my NCLEX. NCLEX stands for the National Council Licensure Examination. The Florida Center for Nursing writing in part, quote, if new graduate nurses do not pass the exam, then they cannot practice as a licensed registered nurse. You hope that you put in the work and it pays off and that you can pass it on the first try. Recent data shows that Florida's passing rate is far lower than the national average. Nearly 65% passing rate last year in the Sunshine State, compared to more than 82% students nationally. Some telling us they believe it's the impact of the COVID-19 pandemic. We were taking classes online for a while that we just didn't have the clinical experience because of COVID. I've seen it in some of my cohorts that, you know, we were wiped, we wiped and uh, deducted by about 50% of our class certain semesters. Nursing students excited about their future while curious what the real world will bring. Going through some classes, some of our classmates would be like, um, I'm not sure like I'm prepared for the real world because they're kind of making it easier than it really is. Recent grads like Nathan Slager are preparing to take the NCLEX soon. Find a trustworthy resource. Um, don't overwhelm yourself with too many resources. And despite some challenges, the next wave of medical leaders say they're pushing for their dreams. Having the mindset of like it's bigger than me is what keeps me putting on the uniform. Kind of push each other and encourage each other as we're going through it together. In Palm Beach County, I'm Sujinon for WPBF 25 News.